Good afternoon. My name is Dr. Holmes. I will be your professor for fall 2020 for COM 1713. I wanted to formally introduce myself on the first day of classes. This is my welcome video. So welcome to the particular class. Uh, this particular semester, as you know, there's some challenges. Uh, we have shifted to a kind of online class setting. Uh, one of the biggest questions I've had, and not necessarily from students from this particular class, uh, but some of my other classes, is about the day and the time that we'll be meeting. As many of you know that there are many ways in which classes are being offered right now. Uh, some are face-to-face. -face, some are hybrid, which is a combination of face-to-face -face and online uh, meetings. And then there's several, two different types of online settings, uh, synchronous and asynchronous. Uh, the synchronous, if you look at your schedule, has a day and a time that is attached uh, to your particular schedule. So it means what, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, or Tuesday, Thursday at a particular time. The asynchronous does not, it's just online. This is an asynchronous schedule, particular class section which means that we don't have a particular day or a particular time that we'll be on Zoom or WebEx or some other type of platform. With that being said, this particular method of online learning is very traditional of online learning. But many times you're not exposed to this style until maybe graduate programming or graduate schools like University of Phoenix or University of Arizona or Walden uh, in that particular sense, where the professor might upload lectures, uh, gives you assignments, you communicate maybe through email, you do discussion boards, uh, things of that nature. It's more of that style. However, I do plan to do some uh, videos. Considering that this is the introduction to mass media, this is one of those classes I really enjoy teaching but I really enjoy teaching this class face-to-face. -face. There's so much within mass media as we cover foundational and historical information, uh, various media or mediums, such as uh, social media, gaming, music, movies, radio, TV, newspapers, uh, books, magazines, uh, the list goes on, advertising, journalism, um, but due to the pandemic, we will shift. I taught part of this class online for the summer. And so there are some things that I've learned about how to engage in an online format. This class will heavily depend upon um, the projects. Uh, a couple of projects, uh, me and another professor who teaches class, we have decided to kind of change due to it being an online format. So we will focus, um, this is gonna be a heavily engagement and discussion board because it's necessary in order to truly understand mass media. I will be putting up videos uh, for you to watch. Uh, not necessarily maybe lengthy videos, but videos, uh, we do discussions, we have something, uh, what I call Freedom Fridays where um, it's where we get a chance to look at current events, There's some type of topic, and you get a chance to discuss and really just share how you feel about what's happening and the way in which the media perhaps portray or different uh, subject matters. Um, usually that's usually a hot topic in this particular class when I've taught it in the past because we never know what could be happening or what we're going to get. And the way that 2020 has gone, it's been some real hot topics. So with that being said, um, I'm not for sure how many of you are majors, or communication or mass communication or even minors, or maybe those that just might have an interest or those who just picked up the class as an elective. I look forward to uh, getting to know you a little bit better. I did put up a couple of assignments for week one uh, as far as reviewing the syllabus, all right, that's important. And then also it needs you to look at the discussion board to get to know. 
I'd like to get to know you a little bit better than just your name on a piece of paper and an ID. And then also the class will be able to get a chance to see who's in the class. Uh, nothing really personal information, just kind of basics. And then also for you to download the Remind app. Um, those particular assignments will be a way that I engage the attendance reporting that is done the first week for the registrar. So you definitely need to do so. Uh, the book is Media and Culture. It's on the syllabus that's provided. You will need the book. It's going to be important for the quizzes and the exams as they'll be online as well. And then also we'll be looking at our projects. So I just wanted to give you a few tidbits. I can tell you also that all of our assignments will be due on Sundays at 11.59 p.m. I will be building this course. I've started with the first few weeks. The assignments are there. You might not be able to see. You'll be able to see all the assignments, but you can't see all the weeks yet because I'm still building like the dates and the due dates and the point systems with the grade book uh, because it's a new system. And so we're kind of really starting from scratch. So as the weeks go on, I'll build two, three, four weeks at a time. So it's there, but not everything is open for you to preview just yet, but all the assignments, things of that nature. Um, I will be having Zoom office hours. I will post those next week or by appointment. I will just have some time that I'm online that you can um, get into a Zoom session or say, hey, I wanna meet you. I wanna talk with you. And so we can arrange that time. And uh, I would definitely like the face-to-face -face time as well. And I wanna make sure that I offer that for my students. So like I said, I'm Dr. Holmes. I'm in the language and communication faculty. I'll be your instructor for this semester. I really enjoy teaching. This is my third year at Prairie View A&M University. And it's my 20th year teaching at the college university level. So I'm new, but not new. All right, so I look forward to uh, seeing what we come up with in this class. This is one of my favorite classes to teach. I really wish we were face-to-face -face for this section, but I still think we'll be able to have a good experience, even though we're online. Um, whatever you, you got to put some effort into it. I'll meet you where you're at. You give me nothing, you get nothing, uh, but you earn the grade, I don't give the grade. I look forward to getting to know each and every one of you a little bit better. And in the meantime, take care. Have a great rest of the day and I'll be in contact.